YouTube, what it is, man. It's your boy, Mr. Flight Academy Kicks, a.k.a. Pastor Flight, Show Flight, Flex Luca. Call me what you want. Can't call your boy broke, because I'm rich in Christ. Back with another video for y'all today. And before we get started, man, I know how we rock with these videos, man. Shout out to all our new subscribers, y'all. We're getting closer and closer to that 15K mark. And it's much, 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 muchly appreciate it, man. I thank y'all so much. Y'all don't have to subscribe to the channel, man. But the fact that y'all do and y'all give that support to me, I'm gracious for it, man. I really am gracious for it, man. So shout out to y'all, man. If you haven't already, make sure you subscribe right now. Hit the subscribe button. It don't cost you anything. Go ahead and hit the subscribe button. And click the link in the description to follow me on IG, man. And one and only, Mr. Flight Academy Kicks. Now, I know y'all probably looking at my shirt, thinking my shirt dirty. No, let me just tell you something real quick. It's raining real bad here. And I've been out all day. I've been shipping out shoes. I just picked up more shoes. I had to go pick up some more biohacks. So I got a whole bunch of inventory that just came in. So I've been out all day, and I didn't get a chance to get... I'm going to just tell y'all the truth, all right? I'm going to tell y'all the truth, man. I had a video idea for today, and lo and behold, Unbreakable Kicks drops his video today, and it was the same idea I had, man. So I called bro on the phone like, bro, we both thinking the same exact thing because I was going to drop that video. But he beat me to the punch, man, so you know I had to switch it up. I had another... The video I'm going to talk to y'all about today, I was going to do that for tomorrow. So I was like, well, maybe I'll wait. I'm like, nah, you know what? Let me give y'all a video for Labor Day. So that's why I was like, I came in the crib from all the rain and stuff. Wanted to record and get this video up for y'all so y'all can enjoy y'all beautiful Labor Day with your boy Flight, man. Because I got things to do. I got to hit the cookout, man. I'm trying to get some food, bro. But look, though, man. Um, Wanted to talk to y'all real quick. Um, So a lot of y'all know that I made a purchase of these shoes right here, man. Carmine Sixes, right? And what's funny is... Let me bring the light down some so y'all can see it pretty good. So what's funny is with these Carmine 6s, um, when I made the video, a lot of y'all said something that pretty much made sense that I actually didn't think about before actually making a purchase. Now, would it have altered my idea or my um, plan to purchase the shoe? I don't think it would alter it. I probably would have thought a little bit more, but it would definitely would have altered it. I may have, I probably still would have bought it. I don't know, man. I don't really know what I would have been thinking at the time. But a lot of y'all was saying, bro, why buy the 2014 pair when the pair's about to drop in 2021? And I'm like, uh, you know what? Y'all got a point. Flight crew, you got me on that. You know what I'm saying? Your boy wasn't fully thinking, and he got me. But I'm still satisfied with the purchase of the shoes. You know what I'm saying? I just I need to start wearing them. So, you know, I ain't wearing the 2014 and the 2021 pair. But it made me think about something that I wanted to make a video about, man. There are a lot of shoes that are redropping next year. So if there's a certain shoe that you missed out on, you probably want to just wait it out a little bit longer. Like for me, there's some shoes on my wish list. Um, Flu Game 12s, want to get those. Cherry 12s, want to get those. Um, I need another pair of Taxi 12s. Even though my Taxi 12s are still good, definitely want to get another pair. So I may just draw back a little bit from purchasing shoes that um, released like in 2014, 2015, 2016. Because honestly, with these new catalogs coming out with Jordan Brand, we really don't know what's going to drop and what's not going to drop. I mean, so far we see that the um, Fire Red 4s are now going to re-release next year, all right? Um, Raging Bulls, the Raging Bull 5s are re-dropping next year, bro. You know what I'm saying? Uh, that's another one. Cement 4s, I just seen, I just seen some information on that. Cement 4s are re-releasing next year, all right? So... Instead of going to grab them shoes now, you just may want to put your hand back in your pocket. Don't purchase right now. Wait and see the lineup for next year because they keep adding more and more. Now, I'm going to tell you, 2021 is going to be some heat dropping. Now, I don't know how the economical uh, flow of things are going to be next year. Y'all like how I put that professor flow in there? The economical, okay, uh, flow next year is going to be. But there's some for the sneaker side. It's going to be some heat, man. It's going to be some heat dropping. But hey, I mean, that's just that's me. I, for me, I don't really rock 11 lows, but I do love the Legend Blue 11s. They drop the Legend Blue 11 lows next year. Gotta have those. Gotta have the Cement 4s. Gotta have the Raging Bulls. Gotta have the Fire Red 4s. Um, them UNC 1s they dropping next year. I'm talking about the SBB uh, 2.5 or whatever. Those, those virtual ones. Gotta have those. Um... The SVB 13s, they're not really calling it uh, the SVB 13s, but that's what I'm calling those. And y'all know they're going to throw some retro 14s in the mix. Jordan Brand, I know y'all watching. Know they're going to throw some 14s in the mix. But those are just some shoes that are coming out next year that you may just want to wait before you go and try to repurchase shoes that you may have missed in 2017, 2016. And truthfully, a lot of them shoes are much higher right now. And the time frame of keeping those shoes are much less right now because as they get older, they're going to get older. And the outer soles and... And the soul ain't going to crumble. We know that. That's just sneakers. That's what will happen. So, 
It may be a wise decision Max, not to just purchase anything just yet, but kind of wait it out. Wait it out and see if it's going to re-release and, you know, learn from the mistake that I did. And I don't know why I'm, I'm, I'm not really going to call it a mistake, but it's a lesson learned. You know what I'm saying? I definitely probably could have waited, but I actually like these. You know what I'm saying? So at the end of the day, even though I could have waited, if I'm happy with the purchase, then it's really not a bad thing. But now that I think about it, I probably would have probably waited to 2021 since it's going to re-release on it. So I figured, you know what? If I did something that I feel like I should have waited on, why not share it with y'all? Because some of y'all may be thinking the same thing. Like I said, they're all the, the flu games I want, the chair 12s, um, shadow ones I want to get. Um, there's a few of them. There's a few sneakers that drop that I don't have. The Legend 11s I want them, you know what I'm saying? But I'll have to settle for the 11 lows next year. Definitely. All right, I'm going to tell you one shoe. Whatever you do, don't buy no cool gray 11s right now because we don't know what's going to happen. Stay away from them. I'm just being honest. Unless you need them for a wedding you got this weekend or event, and you really, really need them for this outfit, this picture or something, that's different. But the 11s, them cool gray 11s, I would, I would stay away from those, and I would stay away from them taxi 12s. Just never know. I ain't saying that they're going to drop next year, but I ain't saying they ain't going to drop next year. I'm just saying you may want to just hold your horses on there and not purchase those. You know what I'm saying? So that's just a valuable lesson for today, man. You know what I'm saying? A lot of them shoes... If it dropped this year, of course, you know, go ahead and purchase those last year. I don't think they're going to re-bring them out that quick. But um, any any old retro that you want to get, they coming back out, man. We know the sneaker game. A lot of people criticize the sneaker game for this very thing. That, hey, why do y'all keep buying the sneakers and they come right back out? Well, it's one of them things, bro. You know what I'm saying? You wore your pair, they come back out, you're going to get another pair. It's just something. It's part of the sneaker game, bro. You know what I'm saying? It's just, it's just in us. No matter what, they've been saying the same thing for the longest. So it ain't going to stop us. From buying them. So they might well just accept the fact that we're going to buy them and keep it moving. This is what it is, man. But nevertheless, man, you know what I'm saying? I just thought I would bring that information to y'all. Let me know in the comment section right now. First of all, let's talk about this. I am going to do a separate video of all the stickers that's dropping uh, next year. We're going to do a little preview of them so y'all be prepared for that. But let me know right now in the comment section what y'all feeling. Are y'all waiting for a certain sneaker or what sneakers are y'all looking forward to next year? And also, I want to see if y'all got any sneakers that y'all might have thought about purchasing, but after watching the video, you kind of change your mind. Say, you know what? I'm going to wait it out and hold out for a little bit. J just want to be. You know, I ain't trying to be nosy, but I just want to know. You know what I'm saying? So I guess I am being nosy. So let me know right now in the comment section what shoes it is. You know what I'm saying? For me, like I said, I've named Shadow Ones, Cherry 12s, Flu Game 12. I really want the Flu Game 12. Why I don't have them already, I don't know because I've had the opportunity like four times to have them. And I just, the pre-flight, man, pre-flight wasn't really thinking fully. I had opportunities to purchase a lot of sneakers, and I passed up. Don't know why I passed up on them, but your boy did, okay? Hold it against me. It's all good. I take it on the chin, but I learned from my mistakes, man. So now, you know, y'all see me out here buying, and I got something coming in what I bought. So y'all be prepared for that unboxing. But, man, y'all let me know right now, man. Let me know right now what y'all thinking in the comment section. What shoes were you thinking about getting, and now you may change your mind, or... Some of y'all may be like, you know, I don't care what you say, bro. I'm still going to buy them. I want to hear about those too, man. So let me know in the comment section right now. But Flight Crew, y'all know I love y'all, man. Y'all enjoy y'all Labor Day with y'all family. Some of y'all part already slumped on the couch about to pass out from that good food. I have not ate yet, so I'm about to go take everything. You know what I'm saying? So y'all know how we rocking, man. Take flight with the flies. You ain't flying me. Just ain't flying right. Hustle and motivate. Long live milk. And we out.